Gee, I'm a tree. Welcome back. Today's video is going to be on triangle theorems, interior and exterior angles of a triangle. Um, basically, what we're going to be talking about are the inside and the outside angles that are in a triangle. First thing, the interior angles of a triangle, they add up to 180 degrees. You probably have heard of this theorem before. So, one thing we need to do is basically take all the angles of a triangle and add them up to 180 degrees. Now, here's an example. If two angles of a triangle are 50 and 70 degrees, find the third angle. Now, one thing to remember is that whenever you do not have a diagram, draw a diagram. So I know the two angles are 50 and 70. I need to figure out what the third one is. In this case, I'm going to call this angle X. Now, if this angle is X, we add them all up. So I have X plus 50 plus 70, and that is going to be equal to 180 degrees. So X plus 120 is equal to 180. And subtract 120 from both sides, I get x is equal to 60 degrees. Okay, simple problem. Now try one that's a little bit more difficult. If the angles of a triangle are in the ratio of 2 to 3 to 1, what is the largest angle? Now, we keep the same fact that we have 180 degrees in a triangle. I know this is 2x, this is 3x, and this is 5x. Remember, when we do ratios, you put the x's underneath to sort of symbolize the difference. Now, I'm going to draw the triangle. One angle is 2x, the other angle is 3x, the other angle is 5x. Now, we add them all up, so I get 2x plus 3x plus 5x is equal to 180 degrees. We add up all three angles equals 180. Now, I get 10x equals 180 degrees, and x is equal to 18. Now be careful. This question is asking what is the largest angle. Now out of the, th the three angles I have here, 2x, 3x, and 5x, the one that's going to be biggest is the 5x. So we're going to plug in 5 times 18, which was our x value, and we'll get our final result of 90 degrees. Okay. Now let's move on to the second theorem we're going to talk about. Exterior angle of a triangle. The exterior angle. Exterior means outside. Okay? So, the outside angle of a triangle. Now, this is a sort of typical diagram you'll see. We have a line that's extended out this way. So, for example, I have call this A, B, and C. And I'm going to put a D out here. So, basically, in order to figure out what this exterior angle is, this is angle A, D. So angle ACD is going to be equal to the measure of the angle A plus the measure of angle B. Okay? So whatever angle A is plus angle B. Okay? Now, let's take a look. So basically, the exterior angle is going to be equal to the sum of the two non-adjacent angles. Okay, here's an example for you. If I said that this here was... 50 degrees, and this here was 30 degrees, okay, now actually let's make that 80, if this is 80 degrees, this is 50 degrees, I want to know what this outside angle is, now, we could figure out the third angle, and then we have a straight line that equals 180, you can do that, but otherwise, if I'm going to call this angle x, this is x is equal to 50 plus 80, and x is going to be equal to 130 degrees, which is a lot simpler. One step, you add these two angles together to get this one. Okay? Um, if you have any questions or anything, you can feel free to contact me or leave a comment. Um, otherwise, I'll see you later. Have a good day. Bye.